Good morning my friends. Today I have decided to put my iPhone 15 Pro Max up to a challenge. Can you see it just behind me? It looks beautiful. The tree just looks completely different with yellow, browns, some green-ish. Half of the leaves there fell off already. So what I'm gonna do, I want to see how good actually is the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Can he give me actually real views? Can he give me natural views? And in the end, I will tell you what settings I have chosen for the, uh, for the iPhone 15 Pro Max. I got my tripod because it will help me uh, to have amazing views. And I got the iPhone 15. If you are new to my channel, please may I encourage you to like and subscribe. I will be very grateful and is free and if you like and subscribe even if you don't like this type of videos YouTube will still share it with people who actually really enjoy this type of videos let's go I want to share with you how did I get those amazing uh, views. This time of the year actually is one of the best time for you to make awesome videos and even taking amazing photos. Why? It's because of the contrast with yellows, greens, browns, greys, etc. And I was very lucky that today actually was a clear sky. That it did help because the sun could come through the leaves or to the trees and I tried to find amazing angles so you could enjoy and I could share my amazing experience that I had in the countryside park in Worcester. Stay tuned because I will make more awesome videos about this amazing gadget. I was blown away actually when I edit how amazing and clear and crispy the image and the video came. I was just blown away. Let me to tell you, I got good cameras. I got the GoPro. 85% of my videos actually was made with a, another amazing mobile phone that I still got, the iPhone 8 Plus Red Special. And that thing does 4K uh, 60 FPS like this one does. But you got more options in the settings. So I'm going to share with you what settings actually I did use and I choose for myself. I try several um, settings to get the best uh, photos and videos and I do believe these ones for me personally they are really incredible. I'm going to share now with you. So go to settings, go to the bottom or go down until you see camera, 
touch on camera. As you can see, he's got different settings. Uh, record video, choose always 4K FPS. Go back again. Let's go here. This, that's where he is. It makes a huge difference. Record cinematic and I choose 24. You can choose the 4K of 30 FPS, but I didn't found me personally a big change. So I choose 4K 24 FPS, but the main thing and the biggest difference, my friends, is here in formats where you can choose high efficiency or most compatible. I'm going to choose most compatible and I'm going to tell you why. Because this mobile phone's got one terabyte, so one TB. If I had, for example, just 512 or even 256, I would choose just high efficiency. And that's why I choose most compatible on photo mode. On a photo mode, uh, leave it on a 24 megapixel and here the Pro Raw resolution, turn it on and is on Pro Max here on 48 megapixels. Go back again. Here, you left to turn. This made a big difference for me. Apple Pro Res. And this makes a huge difference. As soon as you click the Apple Pro Res, I click on HDR and change to log and change to log as you can see it there. That is the settings I did use to make this amazing video at the country park in Worcester. So there you go my friends, hope you enjoyed the video, hope you enjoy the beautiful colors that the autumn does bring to all of us. This was an amazing video and let me to tell you I'll be making more videos and share with you. You can choose the high resolution so the stabilization will be higher. So the lower actually is the resolution, the lower is the stabilization. It means for example if you have on a tripod like I got now my GoPro, you can live on a lower uh, resolution so you're not shaking, you're not picking the camera. So leave it always on a high resolution. So I'll be bringing more videos, I will explain more about this amazing mobile phone that I'm blown away and it would embarrass actually the best cameras in the world and I do have a few guys. So hope you enjoyed this video guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.